All right, sorry about that, but we are back. Welcome back to Four Accelerator. Uh, we are continuing with Russia. We are now in the medieval era, and now the stream should be back online. Uh, so let's keep playing. Uh, I think I want to keep getting Exodus of the Evangelists, uh, so because we're doing a religious game. So I'm just going to pick that. Uh, what do I want here? I just got my temple. I think I'm going to faith purchase the mosque. Can I faith purchase an apostle already? I can, so I'll do that. Uh, we could build the Mahabodhi temple. 20 turns. Uh, that's not a bad idea. Uh, is there anything else we could start? Yeah, let's start pumping out settlers at least until we... Uh, um, at least until we can get the card in for wonders, maybe. We'll clear that camp. Uh, we're keeping our scout here to block this Great Prophet from being able to go there, although the Great Prophet just moved, so it's possible he's got another holy site somewhere else. Uh, let's move there and promote, and we just want to put these archers uh, wherever we want to settle to keep barbarians from spawning. Uh, in case you missed the... Uh, since I had to close the other stream and restart, the... Uh, the only thing that you missed um, was I sold the Iliad to India for some gold and some diplomatic favor. Um, and uh, oh. uh, and then I'm going to get the Odyssey with Homer because uh, I'm getting more great works of writing than I can actually place right now. So I'm trying to sell them off whenever I can. I'm going to put two into myself to hopefully get that one. Uh, I want to earn double points towards, uh, why not, great writers. I'm going to put all the points I can into that. My troops are merely passing by. We're friends, buddy. I'm not going to attack you. Clear out that barbarian camp, the one that caused so many problems. Building a monument here. Okay. I'm just going to promote you with volley. And uh, let's see what promotions I get here. I will get uh, translator. Um, first, I'm going to move it a little bit. Then I'm going to pick up um, translator religious spread. Actually, I think I'm going to use this one to evangelize a belief first. So... I already have, let's see, in other civilizations and city-states, pilgrimage is going to help us get even more faith by spreading our religion, so it's going to allow us to get a religious snowball going, so I think I'm going to get that, and uh, that's immediately going to put us up to 80 faith, because we've already started converting uh, the Aztecs here, um, and then I'm probably going to do Defender of the Faith. Um, let's see, let's just, let's just explore out with these guys. Um, I will move you up there. Pachacuti. Pachacuti. And Spain. Okay, we finally met some people. Uh, let's make friends with uh, Montezuma some more. Uh, he's got all the luxuries we do. That's good. So we don't have to sell him anything, but we can sell these new guys something else. We can also send them delegations uh, just to keep them happy. What would you give me three gold per turn? I'm going to send you a delegation. What would you give me for this marble? Three gold per turn. Uh, how much would you give me? Nothing. Alright, I'll just hold on to it for now then. I can get a better price some other time, probably. Um, I'm going to explore this way with this horseman, see if there's just any land up there that's worth settling. Probably not, but we'll see.
Okay. Uh, so we just got a flood here. Let's see. It did take out our farm, so we're going to want to repair that. We're going to need a builder to do that. Uh, oh, well, let's be friends with Philip. We're going to try to convert him. I'm assuming he got a religion. He usually tries to go for one. Uh, yeah, he did get Catholicism. So he's not going to like us eventually because we're going to wipe out his religion with our own. But uh, for now, he's happy with us. Uh, why don't we... Could get an encampment. We could put it right there. Um, just as a sort of defense against uh, the Dark Lord, Montezuma. Uh, let's see. Or we could just put our theater square down. We do want to put it down somewhere. We wouldn't get that many, that much yields from it, but uh, better than nothing. Uh, or we could just build a temple. In fact, uh, actually, why don't we get the granary first? That's what we'll do in Kazan. Then we'll get the granary for. First. Actually, we could use some builders too. There's so much I want to do. Um, we won't need the granary right away if we get a builder out. So I think I'm going to get a builder. Alternatively, I could get a settler. Oh, there's just so much. Um, time to get the settler. We we want to settle pretty heavy right now. Okay, I'm going to heal up that archer. Uh, I'm just going to put you there and then heal up for now. Uh, 20 gold, uh, 20 horses for 3 gold per turn. I'll take that. And open borders. Alright, Montezuma is whittling down Buenos Aires. I should probably get a horseman down there if I can to uh, snipe it. It's, it's probably a bit too late. I probably should have done that already. Um, but in any case, uh, let's settle. I think it's time to start settling uh, the coasts. Um, oh, there's a barbarian encampment down there, because we would like to get some uh, ships out, some harbors out. Um, so why don't we just settle down that way, and we'll keep uh, sending, sending all these settlers. Um, no point putting anything in Buenos Aires, it's about to fall. Yeah, there it is. Um, maybe he won't get his swordsman there in time, so maybe we can snipe it. Let's just, uh, let's just see how it goes. And what do we want next? Um, probably do want machinery. Yeah, so we can get crossbowmen. Uh, the reason I'm going down this way and it's sort of avoiding the top part of the uh, tree is I'm trying to get uh, district discounts, um, which you can find Potato McWhiskey's explanation of that uh, on YouTube if you want a better explanation. Basically... Um, it has to do with the number of districts you've placed and the number of districts you have available. Uh, let's see, I'm, can I buy a builder? I can buy a builder. I'm going to buy one here. And why don't we build a builder in here? I want to settle down there. We're about to get some free builders, too, by settling. So there's one. We'll be able to repair these horses. You, we want to set you to food and production. This is not a great city, because it's very flat. But we can at least put a lava down. We can get three faith there. We can get a lot more faith there. So let's swap that tile over. And uh, get that plus six lava. And we can repair that farm. What are we working here? I think I want food. And I uh, could get another food tile down here. So I'll do that. And that way we, we grow much faster, which is good because we're getting our settlers out very fast as well. Uh, okay, these tiles are good. I could. This is good to work. Uh, do I want to work a three food tile here? Um, I think for now... Yeah, why not? I think I'll work that three food tile, and we'll get the settler out in seven turns, the same as we grow. Uh, let's move that down. Let's put that there. Move the horseman down here. As long as he doesn't get that swordsman in there, we, we will actually be able to snipe this uh, city-state, which would be good. Uh, let's see, we want to keep our holy site uh, adjacency in. I think we want to keep all of these in. 
uh, governor title. We already got the main governor title that we wanted. Let's get another apostle. Uh, what else do we want? We could get Pingala. We could get Magnus. Uh, Magnus would help us get settlers out faster. Uh, neither one of them is like super great right now on its own with its first promotion. So I think we will just hold on. We could get Liang and put Liang in Astrakhan for more charges. Why don't we do that? Um, I'm going to switch off this builder, put it onto something else so that... Uh, yeah, something like that. So that uh, the very first builder it builds will come out with more... Uh, with another charge. So I'm just going to put one turn into the granary, then switch back to the builder. I'm going to repair that farm. going to work that wheat. Uh, I'm going to get sailing to uh, improve these whales. Just going to put this archer on standby. Okay, I should be able to... Well, maybe if I come around this way, I'll be able to ride in. And uh, these tiles, we could put a farm triangle down. That'd be pretty useful. Uh, maybe we'll do that. I, I would like to get these pastures online, though. So let's work that pasture tile. Get production that way. Let's put a farm down. Uh, three food, one production is good. Then we'll work the two, three. We just want to grow first. Uh, I want to put you on alert. Uh, I'm going to evangelize a belief again. Uh... I could get Holy Order, since we are going religion, that does make sense. Defender of the Faith gives us synergy with our Cossacks and just our general uh, defense, but, you know, if if no one's going to attack us, then it makes sense to go with Holy Order. So we're going to go with Holy Order. try to declare war now and try to swoop in now. And we got it. Alright, and we got apprenticeship by getting the three mines from Buenos Aires. We're going to keep that city. Uh, we're going to repair its monument. We could put down a lava. We can get a plus seven lava there. That's great. Uh, why don't we just put that down now? And uh, we'll repair the granary and the monument. Granary first, monument, uh, then the lavra. Uh, let's get that pasture up. We want to get that olives up as well. Why don't we just heal this horseman? Uh, I'm going to switch this back to the builder. I put more turns into it than I thought I, w I was planning to, but that's okay. Uh, now I'm going to move this into the city so we can get those whales up quickly. Gandhi's not happy because we took Buenos Aires. Yeah, I'll give you open borders for two gold per turn. Vessels large may I can kill the uh, skirmisher with my horsemen, so I'm going to do that. And I think I'll go Celestial Navigation because I'll get the boost to that r right now with this builder. He's not happy. I'm going to trade him the whales just to keep him happy. Three gold per turn. That's not a lot, but I'll take it. Uh, will you give us elephants? No. Okay. Alright, I'll trade it to you just to keep you happy and satisfied. Uh, we'll move you over here. We're going to put harbors down and start getting trade routes. We'll get the olives online. So here we want production, and actually we just want production for now. So uh, these tiles work. Yeah, that's good. We will want to get a builder over here to uh, repair that uh, quarry. St. Petersburg. Uh, why don't we... We 
get another builder. Why don't we get a water mill? That extra production will be helpful. Yeah, now he's happy because we don't have any luxuries. He doesn't. Uh, okay, we put a we put ships there or a fishing boat there. Put a fishing boat there. Uh, let's move this over and repair that marble and that mine. Uh, let's just heal up this horseman. We'll give it the bonus against anti cab. Uh, why don't we move this horseman out to uh, just give us sight to prevent barbarians from spawning near us? And there's the boost to celestial navigation. It's only a spearman there, so I think I'm going to go try to clear that camp with the horseman and the archer. Uh, what can we do here? We can put down lumber mills. That's excellent. Uh, why don't we just make this our builder city? Um, and we can give it some production to help it build builders faster. We're going to get a builder here for free. We're also going to get lots of territory. Let's put down fishing boats. Uh, we could get a plus five lava if we put it next to there, or we could put it there, actually, for a plus uh, six most likely yeah plus six um alternatively we could wait and put the harbor down i think that's going to be more useful because we're not going to grow very fast as it is right here uh what do we want to work uh, i think we want to work these fish first and we're about to improve them um, so we'll wait to get the harbor uh, for now let's we don't really need to build our monument uh so why don't we build a granary just put a turn into that we will why don't we why don't we ride down and just help out down here? Set your course, invincibility. All right, and uh, let's get some missionaries. Can we get missionaries here? Yeah, we can. We don't necessarily need apostles because we're not actually doing any uh, religious fighting yet. Uh, we're just sweeping through the Aztecs and converting them because they can't uh, start a religion until they put down another holy site and move their great prophet because we are blocking them with our guy. Uh, let's now we can uh, let's get a temple in here so we can start getting apostles out of here, and then we will move Moksha over to Kazan. Um, we could promote Moksha to build uh, or faith purchase. Uh, districts, but I want to save all my faith for religious units. Um, but so I will promote or appoint Pingala and put Pingala in St. Petersburg. Try to get lots of uh, science and culture that way. We're going to be working these food tiles. Uh, those are good. Uh, tech wise, what do we want? Uh, we could. I think we'll go back and do machinery, uh, engineering first. Uh, we can settle this over near the iron. Uh, I'd like to settle where that barbarian camp is. So I'll just start moving the settler in that direction. Got a lumber mill here. Mass production boost from building a lumber mill. Uh, okay, we're doing two food, two food. Heal up. Okay, so we want to look for cities that have not been converted. Uh, let me see if India has a religion. They do, okay. So they're not going to be happy if we start converting them. Uh, yeah, he's already got Hinduism going. Still, we can use our missionaries to start exploring. Uh, 
didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. Uh, we'll improve those fish. There's no sh All right, I'm just going to heal up this horseman real quick. I want to start building the harbor here. Uh, let's get this plus three harbor because we can put stuff next to it. We could get like a gold triangle going with a commercial hub there uh, or maybe a theater square or something. Yeah, so that'll be good. Uh, we'll just start building that. It'll take a while, but uh, sooner or later it'll get done. What do we want here? Uh, I think we could go for more settlers. We do want settlers, so I think pump out settlers. some religious exploration here. Get a lumber mill there. Spread winter. Ah, that's not good. All right, I'm just gonna fortify, repair that uh, quarry, move our settler, heal up all these forces. I don't want that camp to keep spawning uh, swordsmen because that'll be tough. Wake up. All right, we found Bologna. Uh, let's get a point in Bologna just to get more science in our capital. Pingala will help. One man's. Let's see. I could settle this here and then buy out to the, the iron. Maybe that's what I'll do. Yeah, I'll just settle this settler up there and then get one down here later. Um, okay. Could look for niter. How close are we? Okay, we're not very close there uh, to getting our next government. I don't plan on building uh, these ships anytime soon, so I'm just gonna hard research that. I like to get the boost, that's why I'm going uh, so slowly through the tech tree for right now. Um, getting the boost helps you speed up in the long run, but uh, it means you don't... Oh no, that might get killed. Um, why can't I move there? Uh, oh well. Let's start faith purchasing, uh, faith purchasing apostles as soon as we get that temple done so we can uh, flood India with our religion.
Okay, we do want food, so we do want to work uh, these food tiles. In fact, it might make sense to purchase a granary in there. We'll just keep getting builders here. Get a lumber mill there. Yeah, that, uh, that missionary died. Let's go try to convert Bologna. Actually, we still need to convert Texcoco. Let's get a granary here, because we're on the coast. We're going to need it. Uh, good, that's what I want you to be working. What are you working? Uh, that's, that's all fine. Oh, I want you to be working that. So you can grow. Yeah, I want to grow fast, because we're pumping out settlers very quickly. So I want to work all the food tiles we can. I should put farms down here as well. Uh, let's get... could put an aqueduct down. Get rid of a, a farm triangle, but that's not the worst thing. We could also put a farm triangle here. Um, yeah, why don't we build our aqueduct here? Only take nine turns. And uh, then we'll get a boost to uh, military engineering with that. fortify these horsemen for now. Shoot the spearmen. Uh, where do I want you to go? Texaco go. Sure, I'll put points into Auckland. Auckland will be a very good city-state to get since we have these coastal cities. Forbidden City's been built. Uh, Minakshi, Min Minakshi Temple has been built. Alright, let's use you to come build farms down here. I'm only going to use these horsemen to attack once uh, I know I can kill it in one turn, otherwise there's no point. Uh, do I want to put you up here and get that harbor? I think no, I think I'll put you here, put a harbor there, maybe a theater square or something there. Maybe a lavra. Um, so I want to purchase that, and I'll go get that, and uh, let's start researching ironworking. Uh, let's put our harbor down. We'll put it there for the plus three. We'll be able to increase that as soon as we put a district there. Uh, let's just work on the harbor. Why don't we explore down that way? Try to convert Bologna. Found Mount Everest. Conquered. 
We're already making 120. Oh, move you away. Uh, faith per turn, which is wonderful. Troubles up there. I'm gonna send my archers in that direction. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this Mahabodhi temple is not actually gonna be worth the production because we can get apostles so quickly uh, just with our faith, so I'm not gonna waste any time there. Uh, I should get the granary just to help this city grow. I could purchase it in a little bit. I think I'll just keep getting settlers for now. Uh, I will faith purchase a moss, and uh, that gives us extra spreads, and then I will... Um, you know what? I should be teching for buttresses, um, because we don't have to get crossbowmen right away, and I would like the Hagia Sophia uh, to get missionaries and apostles an extra spread. So I think I will go for that, but for now I will faith purchase some apostles here. I could get a theater square. Um, I think I'll just build. A, I could build a settler. Yeah, I'll build a settler here. Uh, put points into Arma or Auckland. I would really like to get Auckland, but at this point, it's a little far out of reach. So I think I'll just put point into Arma. Well, but that that two faith is not going to be great at this stage of the game. And this gives us the ability to put down monasteries. Actually, both of these are going to be pretty useful to us, so why don't we put a point there? I could swap this in, um, put Diplomatic League so that it counts as double. So I guess I'll do that for now. Get double points with Arma. Uh, we want open borders with Montezuma again. We can also get an alliance with Montezuma. So why don't we get a... Let's see, will Spain give us an alliance of any sort? No, he doesn't want a religious one. I bet Montezuma will take a religious one, though. And uh, he doesn't actually have a religion, so that's fine by me. Uh, Spain doesn't have a very strong military, but we can just get some sort of alliance with him. Let's get a uh, an economic alliance, sure. And we will continue blocking this holy site from getting a great profit on it. Uh, let's try to convert Teo to our religion. Let's keep trying to convert Bologna. All right, we want to put down farms. What's this? Huey Teakali has been built. Keep converting Bologna, there we go. Oh, it wanted our, I didn't even know that. That was its uh, city-state quest. Yeah, that seems fine. Uh, okay, let's see what we can promote. We want to send these ones to India via Mysore. Can we? No, we can't even walk past Mysore. So we'll save that for last, but we do want to uh, send them down here. So let's move first. 
we'll move that one to there, then we'll promote. Uh, oh, you know what? I think I should go do Heathen Conversion up there, actually. So I'm going to do Heathen Conversion first. Um, and I want to eliminate... Proselytizer is a really good promotion. Um, so I'm going to do that one. I'm going to move to there and pick Proselytizer. I'm just going to keep exploring with this missionary for now. Until I find some city like this that uh, could use some religion, use some winter. here. We could put a harbor over here. That might not be a bad one, uh, because that'll help us get some food and stuff. Um, we could put an aqueduct down. We could put a campus down if we if we had researched it yet, which we have not. Uh, we could get a plus one theater square. That would be useful. Um, why don't we do that? We could put a harbor down later, but a plus one theater square is about as good as we can hope for right now. Um, but we're just going to put it down, because I do want to keep getting builders out of here. Six turns till we get a builder. Across there. Um, I want to send this missionary up to convert that barbarian camp. I want to promote it uh, so that it can spread religion two extra times. That'll give it extra charges to convert. And this one... Uh, it will be a proselytizer. It will also uh, have triple strength religious spread in other cities, which will make it very strong as a converter. Let's see if I got stuff I can sell. Uh, you already have marble and olives. Spain is our ally. Uh, you give us a little bit of gold. Uh, what else? What what would Pachacuti give us? He'd give us two luxuries, and what if, what if we did that? That seems like a good deal. He must be kind of desperate. Let's take advantage of him. Uh, let's go down to Auckland. Twenty horses for silver? Sure, I'm not using them right now. Alright, we want to run away with you. Want to move you down, move you over. We could clear the camp, but I'm actually hoping it starts spawning things so we can use uh, heathen conversion, which will be pretty strong. Kill you, move you to the crabs. Put a farm down. There's the boost to feudalism. with him, but uh, that won't really matter. Oh, if we can get down to Cusco. It doesn't look like Pachacuti has his own religion. He will, he'll take our missionaries uh, more happily. Alright, we just got one 
uh, Barbarian Skirmisher. Although maybe we should have let him run back to that camp. Oh well. Uh, in Buenos Aires, let's... Let's see. Let's build a builder here, I think. We can start building builders over here and start improving all of this land. Uh, let's just build the shrine first and then we'll start building builders over there. So the main thing about religious uh, conversion and the religious victory is you want to have a big moving swarm of apostles. So I have this one right now, but I don't want to really start converting um, India until I have enough apostles to finish the job. Uh, so speaking of that, we should purchase some apostles. Can I purchase one more? No, not this round. Next round. Um, so I just want this one to hang out nearby India for now um, to keep an eye out, but I don't actually want to move it in until later. And this missionary is going to keep exploring. Uh, this one also is going to go down. Ah, Kitukara. Okay, so we can start converting uh, Pachacuti, and he shouldn't mind. We should improve all these pastures. We should put some lumber mills on these woods. Listen. Strange listen. Alright, let's get monarchy. Uh, and then we want reform church. So, let's see, let's build, what do we have? We're losing nine unit maintenance from units, so we'll get more gold this way. Let's make horsemen and, uh, let's make naval units cheaper, actually. Uh, actually, no, let's not, because we're already almost done with shipbuilding, so let's make just archers cheaper, or defensive buildings. We could try that for now. Uh, we'll keep getting settlers, we're gonna put charismatic leader back in, and we'll keep scripture for holy side adjacency. Let's kill that skirmisher. Let's settle our city. Uh, so it is spawning swordsmen. Uh, so I don't necessarily want to uh, convert it yet. I can just convert the spearmen uh, and get it into a good, get my um, apostle into a good position to like keep um, converting the enemy uh, enemy units. So I'm just going to basically farm this uh, barbarian, barbarian encampment for right now. Would you like the Odyssey? For 11 gold per turn, I will take that gladly. Flowers Only by drinking me. alone by moonlight. And humanism. We got a great artist. This is this is Russia. You put down Lavras and you will get more great works than you know what to do with. Drinking alone by moonlight, would you like that? No. Would you? Uh -huh. No. Would you? No, you don't have room for it. And you probably don't have room either. Nope, okay, so I should start putting down theater squares. That's why I wanna move Liang over here once this builder gets done. Uh, we can put our harbor down. Let's put it down here for plus three. We'll build that. Uh, here, let's put our lava down. I think we want to put it there. So let's swap over that tile. Yeah, so we'll put it there and maybe we'll put a commercial hub there to get even more adjacency bonuses from these. And uh, I think we'll just go straight for the Lavra. Why don't we... Yeah, why don't we switch over to the Builder here. Alright, our promotions are... Uh, gain 3 extra spreads, 
when moving adjacent to a natural wonder. I haven't found a natural wonder, so I'm not going to do that. Uh, if we were at war, I'd probably want to pick Chaplain, but since we're not going anywhere else, I'm going to pick Martyr, wait to see what the next promotion is. I'm also going to purchase another Apostle. Um, and this one is just chilling. Let's put that lumber mill down. Let's go connect whales. Let's work the two food tile for now, just to grow faster. Let's keep exploring. And let's try to convert Kitukara. Slowly, very slowly. I cannot imagine any condition which would cause a ship to... Alright, we're going to get two swordsmen and we're not going to clear the camp with this. So, uh, we're just building our military this way. This is pretty fun. It's a pretty fun exploity type of thing. Um, I really like heathen conversion when it works. When, when you've got a barbarian outpost to uh, get rid of. Uh, oh, good. Okay. So, this is the other big tip for uh, religious games is whenever you can get the debater promotion, you want the debater promotion uh, just because it'll give you plus 20 religious strength and theological combat so when the AI starts spamming apostles, you can use the debater apostles as your front line you should never exhaust them unless they're going to die without the martyr promotion or something um, so always save one charge and then you can just use them for uh, religious combat, so we're going to be moving this one forward uh, what's this promotion? This one also has debater, so we're also going to be taking the debater on this one. So you get debater, you get, you get moved, you get debater. And now we want to go for the Hagia Sophia. Let's put you on the iron mine keep exploring. Oh, right. So we did found a, find a natural wonder, and it gives us altitude training on units, including religious units. So it will be good if we keep sending religious units down by Mount Everest. And we'll just heal up the horsemen. Let's see. So this would be good if we were getting swarmed with someone else's religion, but uh, we're going on the offensive, so I want to put all my points into spreading winter uh, with a higher uh, strength for religious units. Uh, City-states. I don't really care about this one. Let's just pick uh, religious. Good, we won the uh, world religion Writing for winter, uh, so now is a good time to strike. Okay, I want to move this um, trader back to the capital. Um, because I want my science and culture to be in St. Petersburg, because that's where Pingala is. Okay, here's another tip. Uh, you can see this woods with deer, but a lumber mill here will be more useful because it'll give us production than a camp will be. Um, so, I probably want to... Uh, harvest the deer, which will give us a big boost to production, and then put a lumber mill on it. Um, because if we go to camps, camps give you gold, uh, and I think production is more useful. They'll eventually give you some more production and food, but uh, that'll be quite a while. So I think getting that early production boost and then getting the long-term lumber mill production boost will be more useful. Um, so I'm going to go harvest that deer. Um, I'm also going to wait on this builder. I'm going to wait until feudalism finishes. 
Um, so I will start building my theater square here. Uh, I will connect these olives. Then I will see if anyone wants said olives. I think I already offered you olives. You give me four gold per turn. I'll get. I'll take that. Yeah, sure. So if we move these units away, will this encampment keep spawning? That's the question. Love. All right, let's get some more swordsmen for free. We're getting a lot of faith, and so as a backup, uh, just in case we get attacked, it'll be good to get Grandmaster's Chapel so we can purchase military units with faith. So I think that is what I'm going to get here. I also want to maximize my yields from this trade route. Uh, it looks like Tenochtitlan is just the obvious best choice here. Um, all the, actually, Texcoco is not bad. If we want mac to maximize gold. I think that production will help, though, so I'm going to trade with Tenochtitlan. I think I'm going to send this Apostle down to Mount Everest and get the uh, three extra spreads from moving next to a natural wonder. I think I'm just going to, since my main problem in these cities is food, I think I'm just going to put them on a food focus for right now until they're at their housing cap, like this one. Uh, these, yeah, I, I think I want you to work this tile. Yeah, there you go. Now it's a nice productive city. I don't think I'll sell you the Diplo favor for that much. Just king, king. Or that little, I should say. <laughs> okay, which apostle are you? You're the one that gets, okay, a relic if you die. So I'm gonna move you to the front here. And I wanna move you down to Mount Everest. I want to purchase apostles, maybe a guru, just to back them up for if they get uh, attacked in religious combat. Get down a camp. So if I back these units off, will we get more barbarians? That's the question.
found candy. I think this this settler will send down here, so this one will send up to the snow. Um, okay, so I said we'd probably want to put the holy site here, but we probably don't want to get rid of the, the only two food tile up there. So do we want to settle there? Do we want to settle here? Where do we want to settle? Maybe we settle here, put a harbor down, then put our uh, lava down. And then we could put an aqueduct there if we want or something. Um, once we have lavras in cities, like that's really all we need because all we want this game is faith. is welcome. Wealth consists in Excellent. democracy. It's your Alright, let's uh let's get some more swordsmen. <laughs> I love farming this thing, it's just so much fun. Uh now let's switch over back to our builder and let's switch over to Oh, we, we just did feudalism, so we don't have a different government yet. We're still in, in monarchy. Um, but let's nevertheless put in serfdom and keep uh, holy side adjacency in. And this way we'll get really, uh, really strong builders. extra spreads next to a natural wonder. We want to move all of those ones down to Mount Everest. Where did our other apostle go? Oh, here it is. Really, is that the fastest way to get to Everest? Let's just peek our head in. We could start killing their missionaries if he's not making apostles. with the Inca. Alright, what else do we want to put down? Why don't we put a mine down on that hill? Temple, Terracotta Army, Jebel Barkal. Alright, let's move Liang over to Buenos Aires. Let's put two turns into the shrine and then switch back over. Put a lumber mill down. And now let's build our theater square here. Oh, where did you come from?
Sure, I'll take that deal. Your embassy is welcome. I'm just going to explore with this skirmisher, set it to auto explore. Hopefully it makes its way down south. In fact, why don't I just send it south first? 23 turns down to get there. Shame in deterrence. There's the boost to mathematics. That was kind of accidental. Uh, okay, at this point, I think I'm just gonna move in here and convert both of these guys because I'm running out of charges. So there we go. We just got a ton of swordsmen for free. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine swordsmen that we didn't have. And we just boosted our military strength to be second of all the people we've met. Okay, so I definitely want to build the amphitheater. Actually, I could just purchase it. And I will move this rider over to fill it. Uh, let's, at this point, let's get the water mill for a little extra food and production. Let's move our guru in. We want to kill this missionary. thus paving the way for our religious conquest. Let's move this apostle in this way. We'll swing around to Mount Everest down that way. And let's build this builder now. send all these healthy swordsmen down to the front lines just to keep us safe from any potential Aztec incursions. Oh yeah, if I settled... If I settled here... And I could keep the woods, and I could put my holy site there. So I think I'll do that. Oh, I can't settle there. That's right. So I'll settle there. One, two, three. Yeah, I'll put my holy site there and keep the sheep. That'll be useful for growing faster. Here, the dark oh, giant's causeway. That won't really help. Uh, it doesn't improve uh, religious units, only, only uh, combat units. Okay, this unit already went through... Mount Everest. So let's move there. If 
I were again begin. All right, we want to decrease their own. Oh, that was the uh, the holy city. I didn't even realize that. Well, that's useful. Uh, we will also spread. Yeah, we'll move you down here. Uh, we do want Mont Saint Michel. Let's put it here. And let's move this one over to settle here, I think, on that plains hill. Uh, Mont Saint Michel, by the way, uh, will give us uh, all of our apostles, uh, the which we should make more of, uh, the martyr promotion for free. Um, so if they die in theological combat, we'll get relics. That that'll be really strong to increase our faith uh, even more than we already have. there. Put a mine there. Anything that lets us improve Tundra is great, because the Tundra tiles are already pretty good um, for Russia. Uh, but if we can actually put an improvement down, then they become real good. Alright, we want to move the Guru in to heal up these uh, apostles that have taken damage from theological combat. We'll move there. Now Delhi's converted. Srinagar's converted. I fan myself in. Religious spread is triple in cities of other civilizations. That's good. That's what we want. So we'll settle there. We'll swap a tile. We'll swap that one and that one. And then we'll put our lava down. Down here for a plus six. And we'll set you to a food focus. Uh, why don't we'll just build the lava first? Chichen Itza, Angkor Wat. That is the Renaissance era. So it's a normal age. Uh, let's keep doing Exodus of the Evangelists because that's been working so far. I'm going to fan out some of these swordsmen to uh, clear uh, fog of war to keep barbarians from spawning. So generally you want to put them on hilly territory. Try to get all these tiles improved.
The reason you want a, a swarm of apostles to wipe out a, another Civ's religion all at once is because now um, India is just going to spread our religion. They're not going to be able to fight back with their own apostles and missionaries. Uh, what can we get here, promotion-wise? Can spread religion two extra times, I'll take that. Yeah, he's not happy because we're converting all of his cities. Who do we meet now? Geneva. Okay. Uh, let's keep building builders here. These guys closer to the guru now, actually, because he just spawned his own apostle. But this one has the debater promotion and can take out these missionaries pretty quickly. build a shrine in here. Uh, let's keep going for... Let's keep going for Armagh. Because then we could put monasteries down on Tundra, I believe. Which will provide us with more faith. This one has the debater promotion, so let's send it over here to attack. Trivandrum. Now, now we're getting the three food, so we're going to be growing faster there. 
Uh, okay, we can put some mines down over here. Can also plop something down here. Why don't we put our theater square there because I want to build the Hagia Sophia here. But I want to keep building the Grand Master's Chapel. Bologna has been defeated. Uh, Tula. Let's just prioritize our shrines. Pasha Marka shall fall. Let's heal up those boys. can't have that. I'd like a lot more builders. I'd like to put lots of farms down, lots of armor mills down over here. Guild. I might start just purchasing builders whenever I can. Uh, I want apostles too. More apostles. Uh, do, 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 do. Getting uh, aquaculture would be pretty strong given the current setup. Uh, St. Petersburg has a lot of culture as well. want that I think I'll just leave these cards as is for now and I'll put in gothic architecture as soon as we get our next government which will be in five turns actually we're not going to get a builder for five turns so why don't we take that out put gothic architecture in Mines down.
put mines down. I want to move you over here, put farms down over here. Uh, build a temple, prioritizing faith, put you on alert. What do you have? You have spread triple strength, okay. We could promote you proselytizer, an excellent promotion. fled into the city. A significant blizzard. That's good for us. It should fertilize some tiles. Uh, we have four charges here. Let's go put some lumber mills down. Put some mines down. Uh, let's try... Let's put the harbor down. Where did we want to put it? Uh, plus two either way. Let's put it here. So we can put something there um, next to the river if we want. Uh, let's put that on a food focus. And let's improve the sheep. Put these guys on alert. Uh, right, we have our governor title. What do we want to do? Uh, do I want to promote Pingala or do I want to promote Liang to start giving us some fish? I guess aquaculture would be really strong right about now, so we'll get aquaculture. Um, so after this builder builds, we'll move her, I don't know, maybe over here to Moscow and Veranoz, Veranez. Boronez. We already have a camp there. Let's put lumber mill here. This one has the debater promotion. Let's kill that apostle. Done a good job of basically wiping out oh, anything, Matterhorn. To pay a tribute of respect. Uh, okay, what else can you get? All right, let's do barbarians. And now you can see our snowball because we've been converting. We get 38 from beliefs. We've got 17 from excess great person points. 
uh, presumably from great profit points, and uh, 132 from our cities because we have great adjacencies. If we look at them, we got plus 7, plus 7, plus 8, plus 2, plus 7, plus 6. Uh, this will be a plus 6. And then we're doubling all of those, so and then we get the buildings on top of it. So Russia, especially with Tundra, we did set it to cold, so we have this much Tundra. But notice that this isn't even that much. This is like a sort of amount of Tundra you'd expect at the north of the map. Um, so yeah, we're getting lots of faith just by getting the right belief, the right, the right pantheon, and using the Lavra effectively. Um, and at this point, you know, we're on our little island here and all we have to do is just keep sweeping. Um, I'm not even sure if I'm going to finish this game just because it, it, it is a large map. I probably shouldn't have done that. And it will take forever to actually convert everyone. Uh, I guess that's part of the challenge is to try to do it before um, anyone can win a different sort of victory. But... Uh, um, but you can see how it goes, uh, and I'm going to keep playing, but uh, I'm just summarizing for right now. Um, I want to improve that marble. Let's try to sell stuff. Let's see if we have stuff to sell. Uh, whales, he's got whales. Uh, I could sell horses or iron. I'll sell iron. For six gold per turn? Sure. Surely. Verily, I say to you. Uh, do you want whales? Yeah, sure, that's a good price. Ten gold per turn. Uh, Pachakuri. Oh, we should have an alliance. How much military strength do you have? Not much. You have the, the weakest military. So we shall have uh, a research alliance. Um, and would you like horses? Would you like to buy some horsies? Uh, you don't have much gold. Uh, what about, what if I gave you whales... No, you don't want to trade silk. And Gandhi is very unhappy with us. He'd give us three gold per turn for that. Um, maybe we should take that. That's 90 gold. Uh, yeah, let's do that. And let's give Pachacuti our horses for whatever he has to give. 59 gold, sure. Uh, let's put our lava down. Uh, let's see. Well... I want to build the Hagia Sophia there, which means I want to um, put my theater square, say, there, and so I probably want to build my lava here. Or I could put my lava here, a theater square there. Yeah, that'll be good. and I'll buy that lighthouse eventually. I want to focus my production on districts because you can't buy districts unless you have the right governor. Um, and I'll just purchase buildings when I'm not build busy building districts. I want to get some food in these cities. That's why I want to move these builders over to build farms. Just the, the big problem here is just this terrain. This this mountainous, hilly, jungly terrain is slowing us down, and we're pretty far away from everyone else. Eventually, I guess we'll want to start just sailing down the coast to reach people faster. Um, but we also have to get over to uh, Pachacuti over here to uh, convert him. Uh, okay, so Jabalpur has been converted. We'll lead the charge with our... Oh, we found Spain. So it looks like we've just about totally converted India. Uh, in fact, I mean, we, we've already converted more than half their cities, so we are... Uh, whoa! Uh, we are 3 out of 10 civs are converted to winter, so we're ahead in that count. But uh, whoever founded Eastern Orthodoxy, who's unmet, already has 4 out of 10 civs converted to them. Uh, so they might give us something of a challenge. All right, why don't we send you down to convert these cities down here? Get a lumber mill. And we'll prepare to use our boys to convert Spain.
First we'll convert Geneva, because that'll be less offensive to them. Uh, we are going to need some more apostles. We're also going to need gurus. Spanish Apostle fled. Alright, a lot is happening this round. We got our government. Let's switch over to that. Uh, so we want Gothic Architecture for Wonders. Uh, let's put in Unit Maintenance. Uh, what else? Uh, yeah, Wars of Religion. Uh, oh, that, that's for non-religious units. That's right. Um... Let's get retainers. We can put our, all our boys in cities and get lots of amenities that way. And let's put in serfdom. Uh, we could... Let me see. We could get a couple more settlers out if we wanted. Uh, any more faith is good faith. I guess. That's a thing. Um, but we want to start Hagia Sophia... Uh, I think we have to just get that. Yeah, there we go. Swap tile over. Put Hagia Sophia here. So let's do that. Uh, so 22 turns for that. 21 turns for Mont Saint Michel. Ooh, we can get the. Let's send this guru down this way. Take 10 turns to get there. Oh, is that no? Okay, there's no Indian city there. That's the uh, that's the outside border for India. Um, looks like the Aztecs might go settle there, but uh, so let's just send this apostle down. Does it have? Okay, it's got the seventy-five percent. It's got proselytizer. We can get proselytizer here as well, or we could have if we didn't uh, use up all its movement. Uh, okay, so once we get the Hagia Sophia and Mont Saint Michel, Miche, um, Saint Basil's will be good, um, but it's not essential. Uh, it gives us relic slots and it makes tundra really good, but we don't really need all those good tundra tiles or like those even better tundra tiles, because um, really all we need is faith. Um, why don't we do dipl diplomatic service next? Get our spies going. Uh, and so there's really nothing else we need over here. Um, I think I'll do cartography just to get um, the ability to travel in ocean, which will help us out um, with our converting. But the religious game starts pretty early, and, and you pretty much get everything you need. There's really nothing else in the tech tree or the civics tree that we need for our uh, religious game. Uh, so now it's just kind of whatever we feel like. Uh, we're going to get really behind in science. Um, we're going to keep up sort of in culture because we have choral music. Um, but uh, the whole the whole thing with a religious victory is you want to win quickly and you want to just overwhelm and snowball very quickly because um, you're not going to you're not going to keep up if you're focusing on religion. Uh, very well with other civs. I mean, I guess in theory you could. There's nothing keeping me from, like, building lots of campuses and building lots of theater squares. In fact, I probably should start building some theater squares um, to contain these great works that we're getting. Um, but, oh wow, the Inca have even more great, uh, great artist and writer points than we do. Um, yeah, so there's nothing preventing you from keeping up, but just since I'm just going so hard in religion... Uh, I'm not keeping up this game, and I only I'm only keeping up with military because I 
cheesy cheesily took all those uh swordsmen. I mean that was using religion, so it's not like it wasn't strategic, but I think I'll promote Pingala just to get the passive benefit from that. Or do I want Amani? Amani in Auckland with uh, Liang's uh, fisheries would be pretty strong because we have a lot of these coastal cities. Um, alternatively, we could get candy, so we get relics. We could, yeah, I don't know. I think I'll just promote Pingala for now. Um, get culture. Because um, that's our next strongest thing and I want to put a lot of farms down over here I also want to get some farms here and uh, here maybe I should get rid of that pasture and just have like a chain of farms all the way up that way uh, I can put farms over here as well in fact I'm just gonna buy this wheat tile to guarantee that we get all this farmland rich farmland south of Buenos Aires uh, let's see, Any anything else we want to build here? Let's just build our uh, shrine. We'll get to culture from that anyway, so we don't need to build a monument right away. And uh, I thought we already got that. Okay, proselytizer. Let's build a lumber mill here. Build a monastery. All right. Uh, India has been completely converted. All right. Nope. It's God's will. I'm gonna I'm gonna be converting you, whether you like it or not. And here comes our debaters. Here comes our debate team. homeschooled these apostles to be able to debate with you. Here's another cheesy thing you can do. You can just leave apostles on enemy holy sites, um, and then they can't uh, they can't produce any apostles there. Of course, this city's already been pr uh, converted to our religion, so we don't really have to worry about that. But uh, you have debater. Okay, so I want to surround this apostle with ones that have the debater promotion. I want to move the other ones uh, to keep on keeping on keep on converting. And anyone with a proselytizer promotion, I want to send against an enemy that has their own religion. Uh, the ones that don't have the proselytizer promotion are ones that I want to send over here to, like, Pachacuti, for instance, uh, who's not going to fight back, um, and to whom, like, all we have to do is really just keep spreading. Um, I think I'll pass over these city-states, except, oh, Candy wants a religious conversion, so maybe I'll do that. Uh, I think I'll move Liang over to Moscow 
and uh, finish off this shrine. I can also put down a theater square. I can put it over there. Um, I could also get a commercial hub there. Um, but I think the plus one theater square is probably better for my purposes. Uh, let's put some farm down. get a watermelon here for food and production. Skirmisher. Oh, poor skirmisher. Old skirmy. Great lighthouse has been built. Alright, we'll put a farm there. Uh, I forgot to put units in all of our cities to get amenities before. Debater, boom. Debater, boom. Goes the religious dynamite. Boom, 100 gold. Spain is falling very quickly. How many cities does Spain have? Have we already? Okay, no, he's, he's got more cities that we have to convert. Speaking of which, let's get some more apostles. have been built pretty late for pyramids all right I need 480 to purchase that lighthouse okay all right now we got food in here now we are cooking up a storm of food it's uh it's cloudy with a chance of meatballs is what it is. All right, let's move our debaters down here to explore. Look what we found. We found an apostle. Thought you could hide from us, eh? Spain never expects the Russian Inquisition. All right, we want to send this proselytizer over to convert Agra back because it's a holy city so it's always going to have some pressure we want to completely eliminate that and uh, replace it with our own a religion of our own
Okay, so I'm gonna send you down by Everest. And I'm gonna give you the debater promotion. Actually, I wanna get that whales connected. Get, get them wha whales. How many turns left in this era? Who knows? Uh, let me see. I'm gonna turn on a light real quick. starting to get dark. Okay. Um, religious spread eliminates 75% of existing pressure. Okay, proselytizer. Let's send the proselytizer down this way. Let's just leave you in the city. Go to the next turn. The other problem with religious victory is it takes all this micromanaging. Um, so you have to like promote all these religious units and move them around. It's a bit like domination in that respect. Um, move them around and like pay attention to their promotions and you have to hover over their promotions. Uh, it's not bad. It's just I, I probably shouldn't have done a large map because it's going to be annoying. But uh, do do do. It's also, it's eventually it's a little faster if it's like, a, if it's not Pangea, so you can sail around a bit more, um, because usually that'll get faster once you get the right text for it. Uh, triple strength sounds good. I'm going to faith purchase a mosque. I could get St. Basil's in here. It would take uh, 48 turns down to 32 turns, 25 production, 29 production. Yeah, that might not be a bad idea to get St. Basil's here. Of course, I already have a theater square there, um, and I'd like to put St. Basil's there. So that, I, I mean, I don't want to cover up these woods because I'm working that tile but if I switched over I only have five pop here anyway uh, I could swap to that one swap to that nah you, you want that one Okay, yeah, so I can't even get more population here right now anyway, so I might as well cover that one up and, uh, and put down St. Basil's there. Then I can put a theater square over there, unless I already put this one. This is this, no, this is Buenos Aires. So I can put Tula's over there. Madrid's holy city, or Madrid, which is a holy city, to winter. Winter has come. Uh, we want to attack this apostle. We still haven't converted half of Philip's cities. He must have a lot more cities down here that we can't see. We could have like one big half of Pangea here and then like a little land bridge that connects over to the other part of Pangea. 
Um, that would be kind of annoying. But at least we think we could like sail to the other side because we're about to get cartography. So we have uh, military units in all of our cities uh, to get extra amenities, and they are all happy for it, so that's good. Oops. Who doesn't love having military around? Uh, sure, I'll take that. We have a lot of grievances with him, but... Uh, okay, now he's furious. Our religion is present in his empire. He has grievances because we converted their cities. Okay, so he's probably not going to stay allied with us for long. I'm surprised... He's uh, still happy with us for right now. And he's getting barbarians, and I don't have a heathen conversion down here. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. He... Where did those apostles come from? Okay, I need to get this guru out of there. In diplomacy, there are two... Uh-oh, yeah. So unfortunately, because Agra got its uh, religion back, then he was able to spam apostles out for Hinduism. So we're going to have to send some debaters up to Agra. Not that. Some debaters like this one. Master debaters. All right. Declare friendship. Send you embassy. Will you declare friendship? I'm surprised. Uh, you are the next highest military after Montezuma, so we'll do a military alliance, I guess. I guess we will just go for humanism. How did I even get this scout? Oh, that's right. It was, uh, Blocking Aztec's religion. Okay, I want to move you next to Mount Everest. You are a debater, so I want to move you back into India before their apostles can do more damage. Farms down. I want to convert candy. Boom. Forgot about that. 
shouldn't have moved that one. That was a proselytizer. That's a pretty important one. Oh, good. It didn't get us. Okay. Okay, what do we want here? We could get a granary, why don't we do that? We'll get whales. Don't worry, we'll give you whales. He looks so sad for a second. Alright, uh, but you, you already have whales. You, you don't need more. Or at least you don't want to give us any gold for them. If you don't want to trade, don't complain. All right, we uh, we want to put fisheries out here too. We'll get lots of food in Moscow. Moscow will eventually be our biggest city at this rate. All right, well, we shut down Agra. He's still gonna have apostles running around that we're gonna have to fight, but at least that's a start. Wizard Wars. We got a debater here. We'll send these debaters up to help out in India. We'd also like them to get healed by a guru. Now have we converted half of his cities? Wow, okay, finally. I don't even know where his other cities are. Maybe it just keeps going. Who knows? Maybe they're out this way. That took a while. Um, yeah, let's just let's just see how many cities he has. No, he only has five. I thought we I thought we had already had three before, um, or he has six rather. Um, okay. Well, anyway, we're we're halfway there, or not quite. We have four out of ten civs converted. We want to sweep through uh, the Inca next, and then I believe maybe this is a land bridge too, because um, Candy was Eastern Orthodoxy, and we hadn't met the founder of Eastern Orthodoxy, so I'm guessing Eastern Orthodoxy, Preslav is that too, is going to be somewhere over here. Um, so we're going to have to let's get like this part of our con of the, of the Pangaea. Um, we'll get the Inca, and then we'll go after. Um, the rest, the, the other half of the world. See how the other half lives. This is interesting, because I thought I did Pangaea, but this is forming like it's a continents map, and there's there's really no way of telling. But um, anyway, we're making 250 faith per turn. That is real good. That is real good. Get a guru too. I'm gonna go exploring with this one. You know, if I had gotten a cultural alliance with the Aztecs, um, I could settle out here next to this volcano. Sitlaltetpeti. Mausoleum has been built.
Need a new version, sure. Oh, maybe there's a city over here. Oh, it's already got winter, though. Got a great musician. Let's build a temple. 666 gold. Great. Uh, let's buy our lighthouse. Let's build a fishery. Uh, let's go fly a kite. Uh, no, let's not. Let's. Err, tough to say. Uh, three turns until we grow. Let's get a water mill for now, um, and then we'll we'll build our lava after that. Chemistry would be useful. If we had chemistry, we could just blow holes in these mountains and then run our uh, apostles straight through them, but we do not have that. We're nowhere close to it. Okay, let's get Relic, uh, Martyr. Uh, let's put some, let's put a mine down there. We'll just put you to sleep, Vivaldi. All right, here are our debaters. Let's seek out apostles. Let's get them closer to our guru as well. bridge that way and that way. This looks like a minion doing a disco move. This is the weirdest Pangea I think I've ever seen. Nope, okay, this does stop. Maybe it keeps going that way and then goes up. We'll see. We'll get uh, oceans, or we'll get uh, cartography in one turn. Uh, let's put down our theater square. Let's see, we're building St. Basil's over there. The only thing is, is like, if we get St. Basil's there, we could get a plus two theater square, but that's not amazing. But we want, we actually want to have all, as much tundra as we can for that city. So maybe I'll just put the theater square down right here instead. And uh, I guess I'll work on that. Uh, this apostle doesn't have very much, so I'm just going to send it down to uh, the Inca.
Uh, okay, so we didn't get Mont Saint Michel, but that's fine. Uh, it would have been nice to get the Martyr, but we actually haven't lost any um, uh, religious units in religious combat anyway, so uh, we don't necessarily need the relics, and we're uh, we haven't been getting any anyway. So um, I will step you into the water. Just to explore. Oh, it doesn't look like there's going to be anything that way. Uh, I don't need to spend any envoys right now. There's nothing that appeals to me there. Uh, Kazan can build a theater square. Uh, let's. We could build one up there. We could put it right there. I think I'll put it. Well, we could get a nice farm farm triangle there. Farm diamond there. Farm weird shape here. Maybe it's a spade. Sort of diagonal spade. Anyway, we could put something there. We could also put down a commercial hub. Uh, we could get it. We could put the commercial hub right here since that's not being worked. Why don't we do that? Um, or we could get rid of the pasture and put a farm down. That would be good too. We could put our commercial hub right there. Yeah, why don't we put the commercial hub here? Well, we could also turn all of this into farmland. Um, I know. I'll just build an encampment. Just because. It'll finish real quick. Uh, what else? Uh, let's let's get apprenticeship so we get extra production from mines. And let's finish our granary here because we really need some housing. He's already got cavalry. Good thing we're not uh, at war. Good thing we're not close to him and we have good allies too. Oh, we found a lot of territory. Who's that? This this looks like it could be Poland, which would explain the Eastern Orthodoxy, um, I guess, and would explain uh, why it's so powerful. So there, Poland will probably be our main religious rival in this game. Oh, we gotta reconvert Madrid, although it is already losing pressure. All right, let's earn extra riders again. Uh, let's reduce the cost of military units with faith. But I'm not really concerned with great riders, so I'd rather get the faith one. Didn't get either. That's All fine. That glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that. stable at Kazan, because we eventually want to make Kha'Zix. there. Uh, let's send you to Alente Tambo. And let's meet our 
worthy adversary, Jadwiga of Poland. It's an honor to meet you. We'd love to sample your hospitality. I'm going to send you an embassy, which you'll accept. I'm going to give you stuff. Um, well, I mean, I'm going to trade with you. Because uh, you'll give us a lot. That's a pretty good deal. Uh, I will also give you open borders. Oops, I don't want to demand anything. So hopefully you like us for now. And you're going to love how much faith we get. You're just not going to like how we use it. There it is. Sacred Path. So she's focusing on rainforests while we're focusing on tundra. <laughs> oh, you know what I neglected to do? I neglected to put in Simultaneum, which will increase our faith even more. And because she was so beautiful, Let's work on the shrine. Nan Madal. Have you heard the good news, Nan Madal? Winter is coming. All right, uh, let's see. This is turn 148. Let's get to 150. Then we'll probably call it for the day. You son of a Poland. We need to get our debaters over here. Pronto. You're not a debater. Move, 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 debater team. Debate team, go! Debate team beta, debate team alpha. Put you to sleep. Just keep scouting. Just keep scouting. Just keep scouting. Converting to the edge of the world. There is no easy way to. All right, it is turn 150. It has been a long stream. Uh, so thank you for watching. Uh, I hope uh, that those of you who watch later will also enjoy it. Um, if you liked, please like and subscribe. Uh, if you have any thoughts, comments, questions, requests, recommendations, anything at all, please leave a comment on YouTube. And uh, I hope to see you next time as we keep the religion game going. Bye.